Joshua 1 verse 1 to 9 says, Now it came about after the death of Moses, the servant of the Lord, that the Lord spoke to Joshua, the son of Nun, Moses' servant, saying, Moses, my servant is dead. Now, therefore, arise, cross the Jordan, you and all this people, to the land which I am giving to them, to the sons of Israel. Every place on which the sole of your foot tread, I have given it to you, just as I spoke to Moses. From the wilderness and this Lebanon, even as far as the great river, the river Euphrates, all the land of the Hittites, and as far as the great sea toward the setting of the sun will be your territory. No man will be able to stand before you all the days of your life. Just as I have been with Moses, I will be with you. I will not fail you or forsake you. Be strong and courageous, for you shall give this people possession of the land which I swore to their father to give them. Only be strong and very courageous. Be careful to do according to all the law which Moses, my servant, commanded you. Do not turn from it to the right or to the left, so that you may have success wherever you go. This book of the law shall not depart from your mouth, but you shall meditate it, meditate on it day and night, so that you may be careful to do according to all that is written in it. For then you will make your way, he, for then you will make your ways prosperous and then you will have success. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not tremble or be dismayed. For the Lord, your God, is with you wherever you go. These words, my friends, are true. These words, my friends, are so powerful today. For God has indeed called each of us to be strong and very courageous. But most of all, he has called us to believe his voice. The Lord has spoken to, spoken to you and has shared with you some directives in your mind, it feels like, how is this possible? It's insurmountable. Why me? How me? How me? But my friend, it's not really how you. It's not really why you. It's really, thus saith the Lord. Hold on to the voice of God. He shall strengthen your heart and strengthen your path. God bless you.